I'm here at the sanitary landfill in Connery. You remember a few months ago I did a story about Devon Lyburn, an employee at Solid Waste Management Corporation, better known as Lord Cut, who went away for eight weeks in Japan to do a, a workshop on composting and different aspects of, of, of garbage disposal in Japan. Now, we did a, an interview with him after he returned, talking about his trip and about the workshop, and he did say that he would be applying a lot of the knowledge that he learned in that workshop here in St. Kitts. Well, we're here now a few months later and we're on site, on location, to speak with him about what he has done so far regarding uh, transferring that knowledge and applying that knowledge here in St. Kitts at the Sanitary Landfill. Uh, so, Library, welcome again. Tell us about what we're here. We're here on this site, a special site here at the landfill, separate from the garbage where the garbage is normally disposed. What is here? This is where we do, we use all the green waste. This is the site where, we, why, where I prepare to do the composting that I promised you. And right now you could see it in full gear. Right. Now, for those who don't know what composting is, talk to us about that. Yeah, composting is a, a series of, let's say, solid material, such as grass, plants cutting like bush and fruit trees and whatnot and whatnot. Even some sort of cardboard. Which we, which we put here to process over a period of time. For age by aging, it will break down. And that is in turn will develop into the compost. Now, this is something you've... This has been implemented then since you came out from the since, workshop? Yeah, yes. This year started like, the, like about the 15th of August. Okay. Now, when the, before the workshop, before you actually went to the workshop, what was usually done to deal with green waste here? Well, this waste used to just go into the landfill just into the normal waste or into the, 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 with the C&D, which is the construction, they really concerned. How about what size this little plot of land here is? This plot of land, I never really took a measurement on it, but this is like a, like a, like a basketball court, size of a basketball court. Okay. And for, for direction purposes, it's located on the eastern end of the, the land. Yes, right. yes. Now, we're seeing a, a little heap here, and we, we see a, a, an equipment also on top of the heap. Also, while I was coming in, mm -hmm. there was another vehicle came in with green waste. Mm -hmm. What exactly is going to happen now with this waste that's here? That, that's here? Yeah. Well, this waste that just came in here, this just came in, so this ain't gone to the process yet. This is the new set of waste that came here for the time we're here. So, but this waste that here before, you could see that heap there, what there with the machine and the excavator and the bridge, that there now from the 15th of August until today, that's the way they start processing. This waste now, as I tell you before, we're going to turn this, this ain't no waste anymore. This ain't any more waste. This become something like a, 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 a asset to us now. We, this is something that we're processing to sell back to the farmers to process the garden, like the hotels and so on. We're able to use this in order to enhance the gardening. So it's like a fertilizer. Yes, it is a fertilizer. Right. It is a fertilizer. Now, how long do now? How long does process take? You said this is here to 15 August. But generally, how long will it take to actually? About to about, about eight months. Eight months. You see, right now, maybe by the end of this year, which is the next six days, we'll cover this. And that will be there for three months before removing the cover. After that three months, we'll remove the cover and turn it again. And recover it again for another month. Then after that, I'm in process of designing a sifter so I could sift it. So any, as you see here, you see how clean it is? We don't allow any plastic, anything that can de deteriorate in it. For the duration for the three months while it's covered, what will be done? What will you need to do now to maintain or to, to help the process over the three months? Well, Every, each day at least, leading up to that time. No, well, you see, that, is, that, that time will be just a day to age. That is aging time. I wouldn't remove the cover within the three months. It, three months must pass before we remove the cover. All right. Now, the waste has just come in now and the waste has been there before. Mm -hmm. How long now will it take now for you to... For it to be fully processed, for you to sell it now back to the farmers. Well, I'm looking at another three to four months. Another three to four months. Then I will start to start to distribute to farmers. Maybe an experiment for that they could experiment and try it on the farm and things. See how the tomatoes and so on will come after they use this. Any idea as to how much it will be sold for when, when it's available on the market? <laughs> not at the moment. Not at the moment. Okay. Not at the moment. But I know it got some good value. 
Now, before we go, is this the only aspect of um, the composting that you'll be applying here on the landfill, or are there other aspects that you'll be looking at? Yes, I'm looking at the food waste too. We ain't gone into the food waste yet. We got a numerous amount of food waste that come here from the Marion. So that in itself, I was planning right now how to harness that food from the balance of the waste. And, and and so that is another phase. That's another Any phase. Any ideas yeah. when that will start? Well, I know I wouldn't like to put a time on that right now. And I will tell you, since I got back here to start dealing with the pet bottles, from the brewery and the bottling, the water company when they come here, I select a spot and I'm keeping them by themselves. They put by themselves for so in the future. Maybe we could export them or something like that. All right. Well, thank you very much, Devon Lyburn, an employee of Solid Waste Management Corporation. Uh, talking to us about the composting that's done here at the landfill, a new dimension of services or, or, or actually a process that's done here at the sanitary landfill. Reporting from the sanitary landfill in Connery for the WinFM News, I'm Andre Huey.